Hey y'all, so today we're looking around Shadow Hollow. It is quite dark on this land, so hopefully I don't have to bust out the flashlight, but if I have to, I surely will. If you're new here, welcome. I'm Shy in Second Life, and on this channel, we check out aesthetically pleasing places in the virtual world of Second Life, and I also sporadically do lifestyle vlogs. So if you're interested in content like this, go ahead and subscribe. Um, really quickly, you guys, if you guys hear a loud gust of wind, that is my heat coming in. So, you know, it happens from time to time. Y'all, this land is huge. I don't know if it's going to be a two-parter or not, but it's big. It's real big. So right now, it kind of feels like we're like in a Catholic church this right here this confessional is giving me like PTSD I went to Catholic school my entire life I'm talking grammar school and high school and confessionals if you know you know are very much so a part of that so before we go out y'all this is my costume for today Minnie Mouse Gloriness, yes, mm -hmm. she's cute, right? Yes, I know. So when I came here, I peeked outside in this little space and then I did a pan out and I was like, okay, she might be a two-parter. And initially, I wanna go this way first. Initially, the plan was to do this video um, very much earlier on, and I didn't do that. That just, that simply did not happen. So here we are doing it closer to the end of October when this place was really not supposed to be, um, we were not supposed to go here this close to the end of October, not for any particular reason, but um, it was a place that I really was anticipating going, but I was trying to clear out a lot of the other haunted spaces and places that I had found for us. So this one just kind of got pushed to the back, unfortunately. It is kind of dark here. So this is like a little cemetery type vibe goings on. Mm -hmm. Real spooky, real mystical. I don't know if this is going to be one of those find your way type of places or if there will be a path. I don't know. So we're definitely going to figure that out together. Y'all, it's late. Now I will say, I don't know if this is like the same thing on this side. That's the same kind of statue. This man, not so much. Y'all, it is 1.13 a.m. Now I have done videos late, but this is about this is later than i have than i've ever done videos and that is only because i did a video um before this video and trying to like bulk record and just did not realize how late it was the heat is on you guys bear with me so i am now putting myself in a position where i'm going to be editing like hella late into the early morning but it's okay. I'm not sleepy, so I should be good to go. Look how pretty this is. Ooh, very, very nice. So this is super cute. Oh, it has a nice little fall vibe to it. Look at this. Look how cute this is. Okay. All right. We're getting somewhere, unlike her. Thick, ma'am, let me tell you, let me tell you, you're a little too late to be running. I can tell you that. If I can't tell you nothing else, I can tell you that. You're a little too late. So I do, what the hell? Okay, so I do like that they have a bit of a path. Is this the end of the path? Sail on bony parts, what's over here? This place does have a bit of a spooky feel to it. Look at this. He dragging him. Uh-uh. What's happening over here? Okay. You know, I thought it was going to be real cutesy, real demure. Oh, is she? I think that's a uh, actual. I don't got my name tags on. So, I don't know if she is a. Uh, 
don't know if that's a person or if that's like a little bot. I don't know. Is it something in this house? Oh, yeah, it is. Uh uh. What y'all got going on over here? Uh uh. He doing the most. He's huge. Oh, wow. One thing about um, the creators in Second Life, when they're going to do a land, they're going to do it the hell up. I love how they have a really, it's like a nice mix between like the fall and the Halloween season. And I do like that. Um, the shared environment here is really, really nice. Although every time I kind of think that the space is going to be a little bit too dark or when I come into a space that I feel is dark, it does um, get lit up. So that makes me feel okay. But it does kind of make me feel like I might have to whip my flashlight out at some point in time. Hopefully not, but I'm prepared. So y'all, we so close to the end of Vlogtober. It, it went by really fast. I know, this is how I'm starting to feel. It, this one right here, not the smiley one, this one right here. It went by so fast. I'm like, when I tell you guys, having a ball, having a ball every time i do like when i did um april diamonds i think april diamonds was when i realized i do believe what's over here it's really it's like really twisty turning i do like that i believe april diamonds was when i realized that i could bump up the amount of videos that i was doing per week because at first i was just doing one video per week and then i did april diamonds and i was like wait a damn minute I think I could do two a week. I do believe that's the time when I decided that I was gonna start doing two videos a week, if I'm not mistaken. Um, April Diamonds really opened me up to that, for sure. Everything is so pretty. Look how lit up everything. Was that a, see, I was just giving y'all props and now I got a jump scare. Look how pretty this is. I really don't want to get too turned around on this land because I do want to see everything on this land being totally honest, but I don't want to get sidetracked. I love how it's dark so you don't really know like, oh, look at all of these pumpkins. You don't really know like what's to come. I really do like that. I really, really do like that. Oh, it's so pretty over here all of the lights you guys look at it this a house can we go in this house let's see i think we can go in here can we go in here ma'am okay thickums can we go in here well we in here so we're gonna look around real really quickly really quickly Ooh. Y'all know I love a good house in Second Life on these lands. Really gives us a really good feel of the space that we're in. We've seen this on different lands used in different ways. And I love how they're using it on this on in this way on this land. I also feel like it's perfect for this house. It's just like a little secret space that you really wouldn't know to look for. You would really just kind of like happen upon it. This is nice. We've seen this on another land as well. So I didn't want to go upstairs because this land is fairly large. And I don't want to spend too much time inside of the houses because I get to panic. And then we be in the house for a long periodically time. And I don't want to do that. I just, I don't want to do that. Look at this. Everything is so like hocus pocus. So this land is so twisty turny. I know that there are going to be a lot of things that we are not going to get to see simply because I'm going to make one turn and then I'm going to be completely away from the path that we were originally on. But I'm not mad about that because look at this. It's something along the way like every little turn that we make i love this fall the halloween season and winter the second life creators really go above and beyond 
and I absolutely love them for that. Um, throughout the year, of course, um, just for like all time, they go above and beyond. But when it is like a specific theme that is circulating around Second Life, they really do it up. Valentine's Day as well. But with Valentine's Day, they tend to just put out more. Um, what do they do? They just put out more like romantic spots. Not so much Valentine y with like the hearts and stuff like that, but it is just like more romantic spots. So I do like that they have lots of different seating spaces and seating options that are very well lit um with this shared environment i love these trees they're like weeping willows that's what this that's what it's giving me so each little space has like a different feel to it but it is still within the fall theme and then they also add like a little touch of halloween so like this tray is giving halloween but it also has like the little fall accents to it like with the pumpkins and stuff like that it's not so much like fall like pumpkin scary but more like pumpkin fall lots of little nooks and little hideaway spots so pretty everything is so lit up what's up here this is a super cute spot like if you have like a little dance hood you can come up here and dance with all of the sparkly things stuff like this really gets me going really gets me into the mood of um the season as well as the seasons to come the end of the year and second life is always a really really nice treat look how pretty this is oh uh, i love unexpected beauty and that's exactly what this is and the fact that they have managed to like mesh all of this together with halloween yeah yeah they they did they big one on this land they're really big one. 